Just some simple flowers outside this Apple store here and who would have ever thought that a store could turn into a shrine but it's representative of the emotion we saw overnight everyone from corporate kings to kids all saying that Steve Jobs changed lives and changed life. The announcement came with that graceful simple message on the Apple website and in an instant from across the world an outpouring of simple grief and gratitude. Spontaneous candlelight vigils outside Apple stores. In words of reverent praise from industry giants, Microsoft's Bill Gates, the world rarely sees someone who has had the profound impact Steve has had. Facebook's Mark Zuckerberg, thanks for showing us that what you build can change the world. In Disney's Bob Iger. He believed in his own heart and his own intuition and followed it. Um, religiously. He also had an uncanny way of always expecting the impossible to become possible. Star Wars creator George Lucas said while others simply accepted the status quo, he saw the true potential in everything he touched. The circuits on Twitter overnight were overloaded and YouTube overflowing with tributes. Just thinking about it, but um, I even used one of his quotes from my senior quote last year. Um, Innovation distinguishes um, a follower from a leader. I was just in complete shock. I just sat there like, this can't be real because, I mean, he he's gone. And Sarah Palin, on the very night she announced she is not running for president, talked about how Steve Jobs helped her communicate with her son Trigg. Our youngest child, he's not able to speak. He communicates via sign language, but he loves his iPad. The world's emotions perhaps best summed up in a tweet we found from Amber Lockhart. The apple in everyone's eye. Rest in peace, Steve Jobs. His impact was so far reaching. Take just the world of music. Someone at Billboard wrote last night, before Steve Jobs, digital music was math class. After, it was recess. And my favorite treat last night was four simple letters simply saying, I sad.